Hello techies. Welcome back to Power Automate Desktop Tutorials. In the previous tutorial, we have seen how to extract PDF pages from the existing PDF and we are going to create and we have seen how to create a new PDF by using extract PDF pages to new PDF action. Now, in this tutorial, we will learn how to merge one or more PDF files and we will create a new PDF file by using merge PDF files action. Let me show you a small example over here. If you see on my screen, I'm having few PDF files that you can see MS PDF, MS PDF 2 and newly created new PDF file. These are the three files which I have. If you see in these PDF files, let me open them. If you observe these PDF files, one PDF having 32 pages, that is MS PDF. And after that, another PDF having eight pages. And finally, we are having another PDF that is MS PDF 2 with five pages. Totally, if you observe, I'm having three different files. Total pages having in these files are 45. By merging all these PDF files, I want to create a new PDF file with all these 45 pages. How can we go ahead and do that by using Power Automate Desktop? There we will use merge PDF files action. Let me drag and drop this action onto the workspace. First, we'll see the parameters. If you see the parameters, we can see PDF files, which files we need to merge it over here as part of a single PDF file. Okay. Now, if you see over here, I can select the files from there. Let me go to the desktop. Over here, I'm having PDF automation. There we can see lot of PDF files. So you can see MS PDF, MS PDF 2, new PDF. I'm going to select these PDF files to make it as single file that is merge file. All right. Let me click on open. Over here, if you see for each and every file, I'm having a delimiter over here that is comma separated. The same delimiter, we'll use it over here as a delimiter. And after that, once these files have been merged, there you need to save this PDF file that is merged file path. Where you want to store it? Let me select the file where I want to store it. I'm going to the desktop. Again, I'm going to select the PDF automation folder. There, I'm going to give the name as merge PDF file in the format of .pdf. All right, let me click on open. What it will do once it will merge it up, all these files will be stored in a file in a such a format that is merged PDF file dot PDF file. All right. If you see over here, I'm having another parameter if files exist. What we want to do if already this merged PDF file dot PDF file exists. You want to overwrite it or you want to you don't want to overwrite it or you need to add a sequential suffix. Right now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to select overwrite over here. And then if you see the passwords over here, if the particular PDF files are password protected, in that case, there we are having two options. First one, direct password input, another one, password input as variable. What does this mean? If any password has been stored in the variable and that variable you are going to use it, then you are going to use password input as a variable. or if you want to directly give the password over here, in this case, you will use the password directly in the password field. Now, once the PDF files have been merged and then the entire data will be stored in the merged PDF. Okay, this variable will contain the merged PDF file. All right, now let me click on save. Now what we are going to do, we are going to display the message over here as flow has been executed successfully or not. All right. Now, let's run the flow to see the output. Flow execution has been started. And you can see over here, the file with the name of merged PDF file with the PDF file extension has been created successfully. And you can see the flow has been executed successfully. Click on OK. Now, let me open this merged PDF file by double clicking on that. And there you can see my entire PDF having 45 pages. And you can see this one has been started with the image resolution, that is with the new PDF file. Let's double click on that. And if you see over here, I'm going to compare the merged PDF file. You can see the starting file, 
that we got it as new PDF that is starting page and you can see up to eight pages. So I'm going to give the eight pages over here. The end page having eight pages right of the new PDF that has been there and you can see ninth page has been started from the MS PDF 2. And if you see over here, that is a PDF 2 has been merged inside the merged PDF file and it has been created as a new file over here. In a such a way, up to five pages that is having the same thing. And you can see over here, up to here, this MS PDF 2 has been there. And you can see the third one from here, that is the MS PDF file. If you see over here, that 14th page is the first one of the page over here, MS PDF. All right. And you can see the remaining pages for the PDF pages over here. Now, if you observe over here, the path I have given over here, you can see the path over here. First one is new PDF. On the top of that, you can add it PDF2. On the top of that, you can add MS PDF pages over here. And then it is going to be merging in a such a way, order in the reversing format, where you have given the path over here. And then finally, it will merge all the PDF files and it is going to be stored where you are going to give the path over there and the file name which you are going to give it up. All right. I hope you understand how to merge the PDF files, one or more PDF files as a single file by using merge PDF files action as part of the Power Automate desktop tutorials. Thank you for watching Power Automate tutorials. If you have any queries related to this concept, please post them in the comment section. I will see you in the next session. Till then, bye-bye. Have a wonderful day.